Can well, we expand you, on that a little bit. You, you, you have to be able to spring a shaft. The shaft has to do that. And yeah. if it's too stiff, you can't do that. So that how goes. much of that should you feel? A fair bit or medium or? Like a lot of guys just read a magazine, right, Mike? And well, they just, and someone says, oh, this is the next shaft, but. The reason for a shaft is like shock absorbers on a car. Yeah. There's no difference. I mean, this thing bends. All right, we're gonna talk about uh, Peter Thompson, which your friend he had a good swing, and he told you he got a tip or two for you, right? He would, uh, Thompson. He used to hit down on it, right? He used right. to thump it. He would. Uh, he said you hit your woods. He said your irons, or you swing your irons too much like you swing your woods. Yeah. And he wanted you me to hit down on it more. Like he that. wanted you to squash it, right? He said you need to, you need to press the down on that ball and down swing. You need to hit down on, let now, the shaft do it. Now I can use this right side to bring all that down on top of it there. That's why I get all that push and down. So if on the you're ball. not going to use the shaft, if you don't take a driver and let the shaft end the game. If you get ahead of everything, or try to flex the shaft. You, what do you, if you let it go, you've got the vibration. How does that, how does that, like, how does it, how do you put that in your swing? Well, you, it's just like you just let it go down. Let it go down. Yeah. You just don't help it down. 